Hello everybody, it's Carl Camaro here, and uh, this is my first YouTube video. And uh, today we're going to be replacing a mirror on this 2012 Chevy Impala. So this will cover anything from 2006 to 2013. Um, and as you can see, my buddy hit a, um, hit a deer really bad. And I roughed out the fender for him down here. And, uh, you know, I was going to see what I could do on the rear door here because it does not open. But I don't think that quarter panel is so crushed that I don't think even the door is crushed too that I don't think it's going to be able to open. I'm sure the handle, like the inside brace is probably cracked or broken. And, uh, yeah, you're just not going to get that door open. But so we're just going to do the mirror today and uh, I'll show you how it's done. Um, I, got, I just got a few basic tools up here. I got like screwdriver, you know, electric ratchet. You'll probably have, you'll probably just have a regular ratchet, but um, I'm kind of lazy, so I like the electric one. Um, but uh, so throughout the video, I will show you what tools you'll exactly need because I don't really know right now. So let's uh, hop right into it. Alrighty, so right off the bat, I see you're going to want to, there's a little, just a little rubber cover, and that'll expose two screws down here on the door panel. And then up here, there's a, uh, there's this piece right here. You're going to want to take that off, but there's a little slot you can get your screwdriver in once you pull the handle back. And then once you put your screwdriver in there, you'll be able to pop that piece out. And then, um, from what I know, too, you're going to want to, there's going to be, uh, looks like there's another little slot right here in the, uh, just there's another little slot you can get your screwdriver in and you can just pry this one out like you know just pop it out there like that all right so the first two bolts here are going to be 10 millimeter and unfortunately i had to switch to my impact drill because my air or i'm sorry my electric ratchet's battery was dead so <laughs> All right, so they're gonna be two long bolts like this. And then the next screw down here is actually a seven millimeter. And then the one behind the door handle is actually a T30 Torx bit. So how I recommend taking off this triangle cover is, you know, just a basic pry bar, um, you know, a little prying tool. Just be careful not to scratch the paint, that's all. And then there you go, she uh, pops right off. And all the, all it's held in is with these, uh, these uh, metal clips, they just slide into these slots. So once you get all that off, those screws and that cover, you're gonna wanna take like a tool, like a wedge, or sometimes they have uh, door panel removal, uh, like priors, but I always like using a wedge, especially plastic. You know, it's, I don't know, it just works better. So there's gonna be clips all the way around the door. So once you start, you know, you'll break one or two free and then you just work your way around. All right, now, once you get it loose like this, you're gonna wanna, you're gonna slide it up over the lock, uh, the little lock handle. If you wanted to, you can leave the door panel hang and the mirror harness is right there, which you'll just unplug. And then you'll do, you'll take off the uh, three 10 millimeter nuts and that mirror, assemb the old mirror assembly will come off. And then you can put the uh, new one on and then plug in the harness and then you just reverse the order of the uh, the installation I forgot to mention you will have to pry this little plastic Christmas tree that's kind of taped to the harness you'll have to pry that off and then you can undo the harness and just like that the old assembly it's gonna be a little difficult for me because I don't have um, there's nothing left of this mirror, but... Oh, the door's all crusty. Ew. So, I previously recorded myself taking the old mirror assembly off. But as I did that, this massive rust hole came out with the mirror assembly. 
and uh so i just paused the video and um i just cleaned it all like vacuumed everything up you know this is uh this is what happens when you live in the rust belt you know this is probably common oh uh, all i can do is just put the put the new one back on and reverse the installation i mean I, I don't know what else to really do i mean it needs a new door obviously but <laughs> like i said um this thing's pretty beat up from a deer hit i would just leave it and move on with life so i put the mirror back on and this uh rock auto version that's where we got the mirror it comes with a bunch of extra wires so you just you're just gonna have to tuck it away if you went with the rock auto version but before we put the the door panel back on we're gonna want to check mirror function to make sure at least the mirror works which uh i hear it it sounds like it's working so that's good i heard the motor moving so yeah i'm just gonna continue to put the door back together the same way i took it off and just like that, the door is all back together, and she's ready to drive another 100,000 miles. So I'll see you guys in the next video. Please subscribe. And if you guys haven't yet, check out my TikTok. Um, it's Real Carl Camaro. That's my uh, username on there. Uh, somebody had it, um, the Carl Camaro taken already, so that's what it is. Um, yeah, so please, uh, if you can, follow me on there as well. Peace.